Pluto made them come all along. It was like it was never actually a section of the nearby planet group's planetary progressive system. Pluto's circle crosses that of another planet, and that is no sort of conduct for a planet. Pluto, the baffling dwarf planet at the edge of our planetary group, is creating a ruckus in the galactic local area. Late reports suggest an approaching crash with Neptune igniting concerns among researchers and space lovers alike. Prestigious specialists, including Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku, have raised alarms about the potential results of this celestial conflict. However, how exactly did Pluto find itself on a crash course with its far-off neighbor and what could this grandiose crash mean for our world on Earth? Join us as we dive into the startling situation developing between Pluto and Neptune. The Unique Nature of Pluto's Orbit Pluto once viewed as an undeniable planet was later reclassified as a dwarf planet due to its remarkable orbit. Nonetheless, this change does not stop it from continuing to spellbind and draw in the cosmic community. Later forecasts from unmistakable researchers, including Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku, have highlighted an unsettling closeness between Pluto's trajectory and that of Neptune. These specialists are warning about a potential impact between the two planets representing a critical danger to Earth. The peculiarity of Pluto's venture around the Sun lies in its unique characteristics within our planetary system. Its orbit spans an incredible 248.8 years, and since its discovery in 1930 Pluto has not yet completed a full revolution. What adds to its intrigue is the exceptionally elliptical nature of its orbit, a stark contrast to the nearly circular orbits of the major planets. Moreover, Pluto's orbit is marked by a 17 degrees tilt to the ecliptic plane, making its path steeper compared to other planets. This mix of tilt and eccentricity presents layers of complexity to Pluto's orbital pattern. Pluto and Neptune's Crossing Paths A remarkable aspect of Pluto's orbit is its crossing point with Neptune's path. For roughly 20 years in each orbit, Pluto ventures closer to the Sun than Neptune, challenging assumptions about their respective positions in the solar system. This prompts the question why hasn't an impact between Pluto and Neptune happened yet? The explanation lies in the gravitational influences exerted by other planets. Assessments of Pluto's orbit conducted shortly after its discovery presented an astonishing challenge for cosmologists. Unlike most planets whose orbits align relatively close to the ecliptic plane Pluto's steep tilt and elliptical shape defy conventional planetary motion. The three-body problem and orbital stability. The stability of Pluto's orbit amidst these complexities serves as evidence of the intricacies inherent in space mechanics. The three-body problem in space involves understanding the motion and gravitational interactions among three celestial bodies Pluto-Neptune and the Sun. This problem explains the intricate interplay between Pluto's orbit Neptune's orbit and the gravitational pull of the Sun terms like asymmetric libration scope libration and the VZK oscillation contribute to unraveling this celestial riddle. Astrophysicists state that AOL libration responsible for maintaining planets in their orbits plays a crucial role when it comes to Pluto and Neptune. This term means that when Pluto crosses Neptune's orbit, it is situated no less than 90 degrees away from Neptune, vitally preventing potential crashes. Scope libration referring to the upward movement of a celestial body in its orbit ensures that when Pluto approaches Neptune or other giant planets, it is positioned significantly above their orbital plane providing an extra layer of protection against impacts. A key factor in understanding celestial motion is the VZK oscillation named after three researchers Von Zippel Lilly and Kai who studied gravitational interactions between three space objects. The VZK oscillation explains why Pluto's orbit appears erratic but remains stable over time. Despite the apparent randomness in space, underlying patterns and rules maintain order these factors generally stabilize Pluto's orbit preventing crashes with Neptune or deviations from its path. Computer Simulations and Pluto's Stability Mathematical simulations in the late 1980s revealed that despite its chaotic properties, Pluto's orbit is actually stable. Minor initial deviations may lead to significant differences over millions of years. Nonetheless, Pluto's exceptional orbit maintains stability over incredibly long time scales, keeping chaos at bay. Recent computer simulations have enhanced our understanding of how large planets like Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn affect Pluto's path around the Sun-Neptune special resonance where it completes three orbits for every two of Pluto contributes to stability. Jupiter's gravity also plays a significant role while Saturn has a smaller effect. Together these forces ensure Pluto's safe and stable movement through space for billions of years. These phenomena are crucial for maintaining order and consistency in the motions of objects in the universe. 
Without these stabilizing factors, the solar system would be far more chaotic and unpredictable. The potential for a Pluto-Neptune collision. Despite these complex forces, prominent astrophysicists are now expressing concerns about a possible collision between Pluto and Neptune. This raises the question why is such a crash, which seemed unlikely given previous studies, now a subject of concern? Neil deGrasse Tyson, a notable astrophysicist known for popularizing astronomy, offers a unique perspective on the mysteries of our solar system, particularly regarding Pluto. Famous for advocating Pluto's reclassification as a dwarf planet Tyson shares insightful thoughts on how our understanding of celestial mechanics continues to evolve. Tyson believes that the allure of these questions is what makes astronomy so fascinating. Alongside other researchers, he has raised concerns that the three-body problem could pose a real danger suggesting that a collision with Neptune is long overdue. He warns that such a collision could disrupt the balance of the universe and lead to catastrophic consequences extending to Earth. A collision between Pluto and Neptune would be an extraordinary and devastating event in our solar system. This crash would release a massive amount of energy potentially breaking Pluto apart due to its smaller size and icy composition. Debris from the impact could scatter across the solar system, posing potential risks to other planets and their moons. For Neptune, such an impact might even alter its environment and orbit depending on the specifics of the crash. Michio Kaku's Perspective and Theoretical Implications Michio Kaku, a renowned theoretical physicist known for his work in string theory, offers a fresh perspective on this situation. He views the study of Pluto's orbit as a glimpse into the future of space exploration. Understanding the complex gravitational interactions of celestial bodies like Pluto, according to Kaku, provides valuable lessons for future space missions. He believes that Pluto's orbit is an example of how chaos and stability coexist in celestial mechanics. Moreover, Kaku highlights how such a collision could provide observational data that may contribute to our understanding of fundamental physics, particularly string theory. An impact of this magnitude could generate gravitational waves, helping to test predictions related to gravity and spacetime. Pluto's orbit serves as a striking illustration of celestial mechanics displaying both stability and chaos within our solar system. The interplay of gravitational forces among Pluto-Neptune and other planets ensures that while seemingly unstable Pluto's orbit remains stable over incredibly long periods. While a collision between Pluto and Neptune remains highly improbable, the ongoing study of these celestial dynamics continues to deepen our understanding of the universe. From gravitational interactions to the three-body problem, exploring Pluto's unique motion offers valuable insights into the broader workings of our solar system and beyond. The idea that Pluto is on a collision course with Neptune is not supported by current scientific understanding. Pluto and Neptune are in a stable orbital resonance, meaning their orbits are synchronized in a way that prevents them from colliding. Pluto and Neptune's Orbital Resonance Pluto follows an unusual and elliptical orbit which does cross Neptune's path. However, Pluto is locked in a 3-2 mean motion resonance with Neptune. This means that for every three orbits Neptune completes around the Sun, Pluto completes exactly two. Because of this Pluto is never in the same place as Neptune when their orbits intersect preventing a collision. Additionally, Pluto's orbit is tilted about 17 degrees relative to the plane of the solar system. This means that even when their paths seem to cross from our perspective, they are actually at very different heights in space, further reducing the risk of an impact. Scientific Consensus No Imminent Collision Astrophysicists and planetary scientists have extensively studied the stability of Pluto's orbit using advanced simulations. Their findings confirm that Pluto's orbit has remained stable for billions of years and will continue to be stable for the foreseeable future. Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku have never stated that Pluto and Neptune are on a collision course. Tyson is known for advocating Pluto's reclassification as a dwarf planet, but he has never warned about a planetary impact. Modern computer models of the solar system confirm that Pluto's orbit remains stable due to the influence of gravitational interactions with Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn.